How to fix a broken friendship. Many friendships hit rough patches, but a difficult fight may leave you feeling like the relationship is beyond repair. If you really care about this person, it will be worth the emotional strain to work through your problems. It may be hard, but fixing a broken friendship will leave it even stronger than before. Re-establishing communication. Be the one to reach out before the other. If you aren't talking to each other, someone will have to make the first move. Let it be you this time. It will show them that you want to be friends again and you're serious about resolving things. Think about how you can reach them. Depending on the person and the severity of your argument, you may need to try a few different ways to get in touch. Get in touch with them however you can. If they won't answer your phone call, leave a voicemail saying you really want to fix things, then text them with a similar message. Reach out once and wait for a response before trying to reach them a different way. You don't want to make them feel harassed or pressured. If they agree to meet you via text or email, it may be best to meet in a mutual, public place so that neither of you feels intimidated or under pressure. Respect your friend's need for space. If your friend refuses to see or speak with you, or if visiting them in person isn't an option, you may want to just back off for a while. Your friend wants space and that should be respected. Use the time to reflect on the situation and prepare what you want to say. Don't push your friend if it's clear they want space. It will only upset them and make them frustrated with you. Talk about the problem honestly and openly. Explain what you feel is the problem and be honest about it. Then ask them to do the same. Let them talk for as long as they need to. Really listen and don't interrupt them. This way, you both get to tell your side of the story and get everything out on the table. Express your feelings without using inflammatory or accusatory words. For example, instead of saying, you made a really dumb decision, ask your friend, why did you decide to do that? I'm having trouble understanding. Use I statements when talking to them. This will prevent blame from being thrown around and create a more peaceful tone while you talk. For example, instead of saying, you were a selfish jerk, say something like, I felt like you didn't care about my feelings, and I felt really hurt by the things you said. Apologize to them and accept their apology. Even if you didn't do anything and you believe the situation is their fault, opening with an apology sets the tone. You could say, I'm really sorry things have gotten to this point. I want things to be better between us. If you did wrong them in some way, apologize to them sincerely. If they apologize to you, accept their apology graciously. Avoid restarting an argument. It's important that you don't say or do anything hurtful during this conversation. This will only further damage the friendship, and it may make things irreparable. Do your best to keep things peaceful. If things get heated, don't allow them to escalate. For example, if your friend says to you, I just can't believe you did that to me. I will never trust you again. You can say something like, I know, it was a really dumb thing for me to do. I am so sorry. I want to make things right. Please tell me how I can do that. 